क्वेश्चन इज फाइंड टू नंबर ट्वेंटी सेवन एंड प्रोडक्ट इज वन एटी टू वी कैन टेक द टू नंबर इज एक्स एंड वाई वी राइट लेट द टू नंबर आर एक्स एंड वाई ओके द सम ऑफ देम इज गिवन एज ट्वेंटी सेवन दैट इज एक्स प्लस वाई इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेवन and the product of them is given as 182 that is x into y is equal to 182 from here this we consider as equation 1 and this as equation 2 and from equation 1 we will calculate the value of y as 27 minus x this value of y we put in equation number 2 this will be x into y we put as 27 minus x is equal to 182 This we multiply inside. It is twenty seven x minus x square is equal to one eighty two. These two terms we shift here. So here we will get x square minus twenty seven x plus one eighty two is equal to zero. These two terms we shift here. X square minus twenty seven x plus one eighty two equal to zero. Uh, this is the quadratic equation. now we factorize it by uh, we will solve it by formula method okay so we compare it with ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 a we will get 1 b we will get minus 27 and c we will get 182 now we apply the formula x is equal to minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac upon 2a so x is equal to minus b b is minus 27 plus minus under root b square that is minus 27 square minus 4ac a is 1 and c is 182 upon 2a a is we will One. get x is equal to minus minus plus 27 plus minus under root T uh, minus square plus 27 square is 729 minus 182 into 4 is 1 uh, this will be 728 4 2 is 8 4 8 is 32 2 3 plus 3 7 by Two ones are two. Then x we will get twenty seven plus minus seven twenty nine minus seven twenty eight is one. Under root one is only one by two. So x plus we take twenty seven plus one. Twenty eight by two. Twenty eight by two. That is fourteen. And when we take minus sign, twenty seven minus one twenty six by two, thirteen. So two numbers are. 14 and 13 sum of them is 27 and product of them is 182 question is find two consecutive positive integer sum of whose square is 365 consecutive positive integers can be considered as x and x plus 1 since these are consecutive that is they comes one after the other so one number we take x and another one is x plus 1 now it is said that sum of whose squares is 365 okay we will write let the two consecutive integers are x and x plus 1 let the two consecutive positive integers are x and x plus 1 then according to question we will get x square plus x plus 1 square 
इज इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव और एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस टू एक्स प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव और टू एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस टू एक्स प्लस वन माइनस थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव इज इक्वल टू जीरो और टू एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस टू एक्स माइनस थ्री सिक्सटी फोर इज इक्वल टू जीरो और एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स माइनस वन एट्टी टू इज इक्वल टू जीरो This is the quadratic equation. The word problem we converted into the quadratic equation form. To solve this, we should have two numbers. The sum or difference of them should be the coefficient of x, that is one, and the product of them should be the coefficient, the product of one and one eighty two, and such two numbers are thirteen and fourteen. If we add them, sorry, if we subtract them. One we get if we multiply them. One eighty two we get. So this will be x square plus fourteen x minus thirteen x minus one eighty two is equal to zero. From first to x we take common, so it will be x plus fourteen, and from this two we take thirteen common, so this will also x plus fourteen. Now from this two. We will take x plus 14 common, so another bracket we get with x minus 13 is equal to zero. Now, the product of these two terms is zero, so out of them one must be zero. If we take x plus 14 as zero, x we will get minus 14, and if we take x minus 13 as zero, x we will get only 13. This is This we reject. Why? Because it is negative, and in the question we ask for positive integers. So this we reject. X what we get? Thirteen. So one number is thirteen, and another one will be thirteen plus one. That will be fourteen. Therefore, the required two numbers are thirteen and fourteen. The altitude of a right-angled triangle is seven centimeter less than its base. If the hypotenuse is thirteen centimeter, we have to find the sides of the triangle. We can take the triangle as A, B, and C. This is a right-angled triangle, right-angled at B. Its altitude is AB, base is BC, and hypotenuse we consider AC. We will consider the altitude as x, then base will become x plus seven. We write let the altitude of the triangle is equal to x centimeter and. Its base is equal to x plus seven centimeter. You see, altitude is seven centimeter less. Then base will be seven centimeter more. So we add seven to the altitude to get the base. Now we will have the altitude as x, base as x plus seven, and hypotenuse thirteen. So here we apply Pythagoras theorem. In this triangle ABC, by Pythagoras theorem, we can write AC square is equal to AB square plus BC square. That is, the square of hypotenuse is equal to square of sum of square of altitude and base. This will be 13 square is equal to x square plus x plus 7 square. Hypotenuse is 13. Altitude and base are x and x plus 7. 13 square is 169. This will be x square plus. Here we apply a plus b whole square. It is x square plus uh, 49 plus 14x. Okay, this 169 also we shift here. 
and this x square and x square will become 2x square uh, plus 14x same plus 49 that also same and 160 we shift here it is minus 169 169 we shift here it is minus 169 equal to 0 that is 2x square plus 14x minus 120 equal to 0 okay from 169 49 we subtract to get 120 now divided by 2 you will get as x square plus 7x minus 60 is equal to 0 okay x square plus 7x minus 60 equal to 0 now we solve it by same factorization method two numbers we obtained product of them should be 60 sum or difference should be 7 such two numbers are 12 and 5 okay because 12 into 5 60 and 12 minus 5 7 so at the place of this 7x we write 12x minus 5x minus 60 is equal to 0 from this to x we take common it is x plus 12 and from this to minus 5 we take common it is x plus 12 now from this to x plus 12 we take common so another bracket we get as x minus 5 is equal to 0 when we take this as 0 x we will get minus 12 that will be rejected and when we put this 0 x we will get 5 okay what it is it is altitude so altitude of the triangle we will get is 5 centimeter and the base 5 plus 7 is equal to 12 centimeter at last we can write the final answer is therefore the altitude of the triangle is equal to 5 centimeter and its base will be 12 centimeter question is a cottage industry produces a certain number of pottery articles in a day it was observed that on a particular day the cost of production of each article was three more than twice the number of articles produced on that day if the total cost of production on that day was rupees 90 find the number of articles produced and cost of each article we will consider the number of articles produced x and cost of each article y we write let on that day x number of articles are produced and the cost of each article is equal to rupees y okay we consider that on particular day x number of articles are produced and the cost of each article is rupees y then according to question they have said that the cost of each article is three more than twice the number of articles produced that is y is equal to 2x plus 3 this can be equation number one and you see x number of articles are produced and the cost of each article is y so x into y is the cost of total production that is 90 given so x into y is equal to 90 the value of y, 2x plus 3 we put here this x same and y we put as 2x plus 3 is equal to 90 this will be 2x square plus 3x 2x square plus 3x minus 90 is equal to 0 this is the we want to equation. solve this equation so what we do we will factorize it by um, we will uh, solve it by factorization method so better 
we find two numbers, product of them should be the product of this and this, that is 180, and sum or difference should be 3. Such two numbers are 15 and 12. So we can write as 2x square plus 15x minus 12x minus 90 is equal to 0. From this two we take x common. So it will be 2x plus 15 and from this two minus 6 we take common. So it will be 2x plus 15 is equal to 0. Now 2x plus 15 from this two bracket we take common so another bracket we get with x minus 6 is equal to 0 when we put it as 0 x we will get minus 15 by 2 that we will reject because it is the negative value and when we put this as 0 x we will get 6 that is 6 number of, number of articles are produced on that day and what is the cost of each article? Y equal to 6 we put here, 6, 2, 12, 12 plus 3, 15. Okay. So at last we write, therefore, the cost of each article is equal to rupees 15 and 6 articles are produced on that day.